what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. You know, and I say social media is a blessing and a curse because it's a blessing in that sense that you that it gives you it gives us another platform to go you know what gatekeepers we don't have to go through y'all it's easier if we go through y'all but we there's another way it's a it's a curse because it allows motherfuckers who are destined for minimum wage to talk shit to people they ain't qualified to talk shit to mm -hmm. there's no way if you work a nine to five and you don't have the guts to go after your dream, you don't have the will, the knowledge, you let fear keep you from your dream, that you gonna talk to me about being washed up? You're not even in the 50% tax bracket. How dare you? How dare you? It gives people courage, false courage, that you could talk to somebody great and think that you should be able to get away with that. Ice-T follows me. He's been a big supporter of mine. And I remember I would get so upset that I would jump to his defense when I was on Twitter. And, and people would go, man, you old and you washed up. I'm like, this nigga is on Law & Order SUV for 20 years, a dramatic show on a major network. Do you have any idea what that check is? 20 it, years. It, you know what though, even if he wasn't, but, even if he wasn't on there, his body of work. But that's what I was getting to. You don't but that's it. what I was getting to. Right. I'm going, even if it wasn't the show, right. the music, right. the movies, the history, the rock group, the touring, this man is an icon. Yeah. How dare you? What, 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 like I'm going, you regular motherfucker, what have you ever done in your life to qualify you to call an, a rap icon like Ice-T washed up? That don't even begin to make sense. Mm -hmm. So look, it's, it's a good tool that allows fans to possibly mingle with their favorite celebrities. But it also sucks because it can be disrespectful. And my whole thing has always been not saying these celebrities going to do something for you because 90% of the time, they won't. 90% of the time, they don't even respond to you. And they act like they don't give a fuck about you no matter how much you compliment them and show them love. But there is a window. And even if you don't get nothing but advice, if you're an actor and Wesley Snipes responds to you, Sam Jackson, Don Cheadle, who all follow me, respond to you, that's worth something. Why would you blow that opportunity? Because you want to front and act like you bigger than them or you want to be disrespectful and put your dick on the table. That's dumb. Mm -hmm. That's fucking dumb. I agree. I agree absolutely 100%. So what, so what are we going to do now? Like, so the dates have been canceled. What, what's, what is the, I guess there's, is, there's no plan in sight right now, immediately plan in sight for any type of new dates because they don't even know when this country is going to be back up. And well, running. Again, again, they said the target is April 30th. So, which means that by May, everything technically should be back open for business. Right. We should start going back towards normalcy. So, so the, that's what they're saying. So, in the meantime, if somebody want to get with, 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 with get, a, get a taste of what Aries is doing, they're going to catch you on where? Instagram? Catch me on Instagram, but more importantly, because I need the support, um, I have a podcast. It's called Spears and Steinberg, The Jew and the Jerk. Uh, it's available through iTunes, Apple, Google Play, Spotify, Amazon, and Spearsburg.com. Or you could just send me a DM in my Instagram under Aerie Spears, and I'll personally send you a link. You know what? And I'll put a, I'll put a link in the description also when, after we end the broadcast. I'll put a link in there so they can just easily just click on and bam. Right. Uh, and go right to it. In fact, you know what? I can do it right now while we're on. Um, what is the, uh, what's, what's the uh, site? It's called Spears, it's called Spearsburg, S-P-E-A-R-S. Yeah. 
B E R G dot com. Spearsburg. Yeah. Okay. Dot com. Okay, there you go, fam. Yeah. There's the link. So there it is. And this is and this is where again I'm gonna make a plea to my people. Like Hollywood, all this entertainment shit, it's like high school. There's clubs and cliques. The jocks sit with the jocks, the nerds with the nerds, the goth kids with the goth kids. And I've tried to get on certain other podcasts because to be successful in the podcast world, it helps to be on other people's podcasts. And I've been turned down by some of the type, top white boys in the game. Mm -hmm. So again, I don't want to be, I'm not going to be hat in hand, help me, help me, help me. So I'm going to make a plea to my people. Please support the podcast. It's free. Download it. Spearsburg.com. It's available on all major uh, streaming platforms. Download it. We need to, we need to, we need to grow. Yeah, absolutely. You know, build, build it and they'll come. That's the way I yeah, look. Well, that's what I'm trying to do. If you build it, you know, if you build it, they'll come. We, we straight, we straight cocaine, baby. No, 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 nothing to di dilute it. We blue magic, blue magic. Like Pepsi, that's a brand name. What the haters talking about? Yeah.